Hey guys, what's up Aries? Thanks for watching, appreciate it. This is going to be a reading for your immediate future, the situation, any obstacles in your way, and the outcome of that situation. So keep in mind that the energies can go both ways. This could be your energy or the energy of the person you're dealing with, somebody around you. So flip it how you need to. Also remember it's a general reading, so just take what's yours, leave the rest behind. If it does resonate, please make sure to like and subscribe below. Also if you guys like to contact me for our personal reading, that's below as well. I wanted to quickly share with you guys, I'm so excited to announce that I am now going to be offering live phone readings. Um, you can find information about that on my website. You can also call directly from the website um, or you can find uh, information down below in the description box. Availability is also available on the website. So make sure you check that out as well as you can now purchase uh, readings directly from the website, not just through Etsy. So if you're interested in a phone reading, make sure that you check that out. Alright, immediate future for Aries. If you guys haven't already, make sure you check out your year ahead. Uh, break it down month by month. I'll put a link to that down below as well. Alright, you got the Page of Swords, the Joey, I see you, you got somebody sparring, could be a Cancer Pisces, doesn't have to be, but it looks like somebody's trying to return, and it looks like they've already kind of been spying, or they are around now, and some type of move is about to be made that you don't even see right now. Show me this Page of Swords for Aries, please. The nine of swords for a stun. You, you're like you're moving forward. Um, you could be going back to school. You could be studying something. But you're with the nine of pentacles. You could be single. Uh, really focused on your money. Even if you're not single, like really just focus on self, on money, on career. Tell me about that. You want to just tell me something. You know, it looks like somebody's trying, for some it's somebody returning, for others it's somebody trying to, re, uh, like, approach you. But it also looks like you have a lot of love for whatever you're doing, like you really care about whatever you're doing. Um, but you have the Eight of Pentacles and the Six of Pentacles, so that's kind of a cool energy. Uh, it's actually awesome, the Eight, the Six, Eight, and Nine, whatever you're doing on a financial level, like, um, especially around career, it's really going to pay off. Like, if you are going back to school or if you've been, like, learning something new, it's going to pay off in a big way. That's a hell of a financial, like, you could be a boss lady. It does look like for some, you have somebody there who's kind of, like, intimidated to approach you. Show me this judgment. But it really looks like all focus is on money career making that money and this it's gonna pay off so keep going for it show me this judgment the king of wands that's you for some you could be done with another um fire sign somebody could be like especially if you're trying to start your own business or something like that because this is definitely like entrepreneur status Damn, the Emperor, that's your energy again, the Ten of Pentacles, what, it, it's, your money, or whatever you're doing, like, career-wise, that direction, is going to pay off huge, and somehow, I don't know how that relates back to somebody spying, maybe you have somebody looking at you for, like, a job position or something like that, because of the Ten of Pentacles, you're just, your finances are magnifying. Show me this moon for um, Aries for the outcome. The moon is such an intriguing card just because it's about things that are hidden, that are not seen yet. Show me this moon. I don't want that many. Oh shit, shoot. Show me this moon, please. Thank you. The Queen of Cups. Ooh, what's that? 
Alright, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, Energy. Could be doing something that's like really creative, but it also relates back to this Page of Cups over here. The Three of Pentacles. You could be, um, for some working on like some type of, of group project. Show me that there's some type of communication that comes in. Um, or some type of really forward movement. You could be doing something in communications with the emperor, but uh, also for some, this could be like an opportunity to, like I said, work or collaborate with someone. What is that eight of wands? You could be traveling. The six of cups. You could be doing something with like a sibling or something like that. But for some, you do have somebody that's, like, uh, reaching out. But it feels like this is all about your finances. The Nine of Swords. Don't get caught in your head. Don't get worried. Don't get nervous. That might be somebody else's energy, though. You're moving up in a huge way. All right, Aries. I hope this helped. If it resonated, please make sure that you like and subscribe below. If you guys would like to contact me for our personal reading, that information is below as well. You guys take care and I'll see you next time. Bye.